We, I wanted to, because this is like we always make headlines with this, bring up the Hall of Fame. Right. Where Have you ever made a statement about uh, the guys who are coming up who were in the steroid era? No. Like whether they should be in or out? No. So I've never whether, made one. Okay, so let's do it right now. It? Barry Bonds, in or out? Uh, out. Ooh. Oh. Alex Rodriguez. Out. Oh. Well, so Barry Bonds, he never tested positive, right? Well, but why is the end? I don't, I don't understand. Yeah. So uh, it, it's. So do you not you not fall under the like it's part of the history of the game whether well, it's good bad it, it's, whatever it may it's, be. You know what? No, but they all they all these guys had already broke my record. I never had a record, right. you know. But I know the Mike Schmitz and the and the Reggies and 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 the home run hitters, the Herman Killebrews, who's gone on and passed away. They always they always because these guys passed them in home runs. Right. And they were always saying, if they let these guys in, I'm never coming back. Huh. And I respect their opinion. Okay. Um, I, I, to me, it's like Pete Rose. Uh, you know, there's a, there's a thing in every, every Major League be- Baseball stadium. It's a two-foot by three-foot placard. Yep. If you gamble on baseball while in uniform, you are suspended for life. Right. right? Well, yeah. I think the evidence is, and that's why he's gone. Yeah. There's no placard in there with about steroids now, but, you know, it was so rampant there for a while. What about, what about an, like, a wing in the Hall of Fame that has an asterisk where it's like, these guys are part of the ge- history of the game? Because, well, like, Barry Bonds is part of the history of yes. the game. Whether, mm-hmm. you, like, people want it or not, he is. Same with Alex Rodriguez, same with Roger Clemens, like all these guys. Do you, would you be okay with that? Something Probably. Like, hey, these guys should be honored in some way. Probably. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because, I mean, that's really what yeah. it is, kind of a museum at the end of the day. Mm-hmm. It's also tough to keep track of which pitchers we're using, too. Right. It's a lot more eye-popping True. when you see, oh, Brady Anderson hit 50 home runs this year, then went back to hitting, you know, Are you saying 12, he did 13. Steroids? Actually, <laughs> Cal Ripken told us yeah. that he didn't. Cal said really? no. Cal, Cal made no idea. That he, yeah. I'm saying, like, we, when, you, when you look at batters, it's very easy to see a spike in the numbers like that. Mm-hmm. With pitchers, it's like a little bit more nebulous. You don't know, like, okay, this guy had a great year. Well, you don't see year. any pitchers that are just buff like that, you know? Yeah. You don't see them that are just that buffed. Well, yeah. all, I know, all I know is baseball got really hard when I was 40, and for some people, it's, it's getting easier. Bartolo Colon, he's jacked up. Yeah, yeah, it's true. <laughs> he's flexible. Was there a year, what was the, was there like a moment where you're like, holy shit, this game is so much harder than it used to be? Like an I exact say, moment? No, I don't think there was an exact moment. I mean, I, I, I used to love to be able to, I, I used to be uh, able to hit a fastball. Right. I don't care how hard it was, I could hit it. And all of a sudden, you're starting to foul off fastballs up here up here 93 90 what i used to say, you just go how did i miss that right and then you did it again you'd foul it off mm-hmm. and i'm going how did i miss that one you know and it's kind of going god I, you know what i am maybe my bat's too big so i went down to a smaller bat I went down to 31 ounce rather than 32 instead of right. 34 inches i went 33 and a half so i'm sitting there still couldn't catch up with it but you just you lose you lose that little bit of of quickness in your swing you yep. know yeah that can, and yeah. and 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 I knew I knew it was time for me to retire cat when when I used to pride myself on being the first one in the locker room and one of the last ones to leave and all of a sudden I was one of the last guys in the locker room and one of the first to leave right uh-huh. and if I got a hit that helped the team win a ball game I mean I got goosebumps and if I struck out, I was pissed. All right. of a sudden, I didn't get goosebumps anymore. And I didn't get mad anymore. Yeah. So I'm saying, okay, I think the game got me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I think the game got me. By the way, you just did something that I love when our guests do. It's only a few guests, but calling me just Cat. Cat. Fucking love it. Okay. That's the, I mean, it's Mr. the best. Cat. Every time someone's Big like, cat. it's only a few yeah. people. No, no, right. it's only a few people. And you are the perfect person to say Cat. You know what? Right. It's always like my favorite thing that happens. So there you go. 